Hey guys, Gamescom is currently going on and there's a bunch of cool stuff happening. So if you guys don't want to miss out, head on over to our website for all your Gamescom needs. But for now, on to the fix. Ubisoft always releases a new Assassin's Creed title every year. Hello. What? No. There's no new Assassin's Creed title next year? Just like 2016, 2019 will be another year without an Assassin's Creed game. Ubisoft CEO Yves Guimot said, On Assassin's, we had a game in 2017 and we have one this year. But we are not going to have a full-fledged Assassin's next year. That said, there won't be any spin-off or a smaller game, but most likely, there will be a DLC for the upcoming Assassin's Creed Odyssey. The company didn't detail what any of the content will be, but Eurogamer reports that it could include an Atlantis-themed expansion for the game. You can expect Assassin's Creed Odyssey on the PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and PC on the 5th of October this year, and after that, it's a long wait until 2020 till we see another Assassin's Creed main title. Well, maybe that's a good thing. Have you been chasing that chicken dinner dream but never attaining it? Well, as they say, practice makes perfect and PUBG is allowing you to do just that. Player Unknown's Battlegrounds will be getting a training mode that allows 5 to 20 players to practice and improve their skills in a 2x2km map. The announcement came via Steam, mentioning that this new mode is part of the fixed PUBG campaign that was announced earlier this month which aims to make PUBG into a better, more stable and fairer game. The training mode will allow players to practice all aspects of PUBG from driving the game's various vehicles around the island's racetracks, to practicing parachute landings on scattered targets, to mastering the perfect peak shot. The training mode is set to drop in September but there is no word on when the mode will be out on mobile or if it will be there at all. Well guys, it's time to get good! Crazy Rich Asians is currently the talk of the town. So if you're a crazy rich Asian, a rich Asian or just, you know, plain crazy, here's something to celebrate. Warner Brothers is bringing out a sequel to the movie. THR reported that the studio is now moving forward with the project, though it hasn't been officially greenlit just yet. Warner Brothers also plans to bring back most of the core creative team from the first film, which includes director John M. Chu and screenwriters Peter Chiarelli and Adele Lim. The main cast are also likely to return and among them, Constance Wu as Rachel and Henry Golding as Nick. Warner Brothers has the option for author Kevin Kwan's entire Crazy Rich Asians trilogy with the two sequels being China Rich Girlfriend and Rich People Problems. Fingers crossed the sequel will be set in Southeast Asia again. If you guys haven't seen Crazy Rich Asians, maybe you should. Honestly, for me, I'm here just to see the Crazy Rich part of the movie. And that's all for today. Don't forget, you can catch more daily fix and news on our website, c.ig.com or our YouTube channel. Today is Thursday, so happy Thursday and I'll see you guys tomorrow.